This is our beautiful 2024 Cadillac Escalade Sport ESV with the three liter diesel. Uh, this one's in galactic gray metallic. This is personally one of my favorite colors on these vehicles. I'll go through, show you the whole uh, vehicle, all the options and features on it here. So with the Sport, obviously you can see it's got the black grille, all black uh, rims there, as well as the monochrome uh, emblems there. Quite a nice touch. The Sport, again, my preference as far as trim. I quite like the blacked out look there. This galactic gray is a really nice color. It changes quite a bit in the light. So at night, it's gonna look pretty well all black. During the day, you can see it's got this kind of grayish tinge to it here. Um, I like it a lot because it's a lot better than a black vehicle as far as hiding scratches, um, you know, rut or dirt, stuff like that on the vehicle. Um, it washes up quite nice and looks quite sharp there. So coming around to the back, this one is an ESV. Tons of space here. Go ahead and open it up here for you. So, tons of space in the back being an ESV. Um, you do have also the uh, <clears throat> drop down for your back seats there. So you can drop lower and raise these back seats here, as you can see, and raise them. And then as well, you can drop down the middle row seats. You just can't raise them. You also have a three-prong power outlet, the all-weather floor liners here, <clears throat> uh, and then the AKG speaker system. So tons of space in the back, even with the back seats up. You do also have a trailer hitch. It's just tucked in underneath that uh, panel there. Coming around again to the side. So you'll notice kind of the color changed now with this side being uh, facing away from the sun. Notice it looks quite a bit darker on this side compared to the other. Again, really nice color in my opinion, uh, changes a lot in the light. So with the Escalades, you will have the, uh, the keyless entry, obviously a beautiful leather interior here. Again, all weather floor liners all throughout the vehicle. And then here's your uh, controls for the rear uh, climate control. So you do have the heated seats as well there for the rear, as well as your two USB ports. In a, 120 volt power outlet back here as well. Now, taking a look at our dash here. This is our nice dash that comes with these models here. I'm gonna show you all the features. <clears throat> so, you'll have onboard navigation, Sirius XM, AM, FM radio, all of that. You do have the park assist with the assisted parking, meaning that the vehicle can actually park itself. Um, you just have to control the brakes, but perpendicular, parallel parking, all that stuff, the vehicle will be capable of doing that for you. Um, as well, you will have Android, Android Auto as well as Apple CarPlay, all Bluetooth options there. You do have a Wi-Fi hotspot that'll come with the vehicle as well there. Um, your rear climate controls as well as your front climate controls. The navigation here, this is all powered by Google, as you can see there. And then we'll go back. You also will have access to the trailering app, so you can set up different trailer profiles. You have a video recorder. Um, ambient lighting throughout the vehicle as well as all the perimeter lighting there. You'll also have access to the My Cadillac app where you can download that to your phone, remote start your vehicle, check its location, all that stuff. Down below are all the climate controls. So you've got dual climate throughout the vehicle there as well as your heated and vented seats and a heated steering wheel there. Just down below that you have all the controls for the dash. So it's all touchscreen, but you do also have these controls here as well. And down below that, now this is our actual dash, as you can see here. Um, you do also have the super cruise option, as you can see the strip on the light. So the vehicle is capable of autonomous driving on all the major highways in Canada there. <clears throat> Taking a look at the front seats here. As you can see, again, all leather interior, AKG speaker system built right into the headrest there. And then you've got the nice big panoramic sunroof to go with that. All power adjustable seats as well <coughs> with your memory seat function, your power adjustable mirrors, as well as power folding. 
To the left of the steering wheel, we've got all your four wheel drive options right here with your trailer brake controller. And then the steering wheel itself is a fully telescopic steering wheel, all power adjustable there. You've also got all your options here for your push to talk function, as well as your silent mode, or pardon me, your projection mode. So what this option does, uh, if the people in the front are speaking, it's going to play your voice for the people in the back through the speaker system so that they can hear them better. It's actually a great system, works really well. And then you've got all your controls for the dash right there as well. Now this side of the dash is all touchscreen, so you've got your trip one, trip two, and then as well all the different options for your uh, dash here. So you've got your gauge, you can pull up your navigation right on the actual display. That's just not working yet because it hasn't been PDI'd, but that is available for you. And then you have your augmented reality camera as well available as you can see here. And then just above that, you've got your universal garage door opener, all the controls for the, uh, for the panoramic sunroof, your OnStar options. This one does have the tech package as well. So you've got the rear view camera mirror, and then you also have the heads up display, displaying your speed on the windshield. Absolutely beautiful vehicle. Let me know what you think of it.